In this video, we'll go through the steps to ship an order from your ERP or e-commerce interface. Click the Rate Ship menu item. This will bring you to the Source Document page. Select the document heading for the type of document you want to ship. If you know the order number, you can type it directly into the order number field. Or you can browse all orders using the filters to narrow your results. To ship the order, select it and either click the truck icon or the Create Shipment button. Starship now imports the shipment and it opens up on the Shipment Editor screen. When you see some areas highlighted in red, that means that you'll need to enter some information there. Typically, you'd now select the carrier and service if they weren't imported with the order. You could also select a different carrier account or billing account if you have more than one. Next, you have to handle your packaging. If your items aren't already packed, you can drag and drop them into packaging. Next, enter the package weight. You can type in the weight or use an electronic scale to weigh the packages. Add any other shipment details that you want to include in the shipment. For example, set shipment details, such as package or shipment options. So as you can see, Starship will automatically rate the shipment based on the carrier and service you selected. You can also choose Rate Shop from the Rate menu to shop rates from all your carriers. When you're done editing the shipment, click the Ship Process button to ship the order and generate any labels or shipping documents. You can view and open recent shipments from the Shipment icon on the toolbar. Click on the Shipment number to open the shipment. This allows you to reprint any shipping documents that were generated and check the shipment status. For more help with shipping, see the links in the video description. And thanks again for watching.